Major spoilers for goes all in on post credits scenes, with two extra sequences after the movie ends. One in the middle of the names, one at the very end, that give a bit more time with new characters and vastly expand where the DC Films franchise is heading. Today we're going to take a deep dive into what happens in both, what their comic influences are and, most importantly, the movies they tease. While the DCEU has had post credit scenes before, teased the League's formation, this is the first time the main Zack Snyder series has. Indeed, it can definitely be read as the franchise trying to marvelize, and at least one appears to be the product of Joss Whedon's reshoots. Nevertheless, it more generally represents the franchise's expansion, both in terms of tone and story. But in what direction? The mid credit scene Superman vs. The Flash This page Superman vs. The Flash The mid credit scene takes us back to Kansas where Superman and The Flash are preparing to resolve who really is the fastest member of the League with a race to the coast. They joke about how it's just a friendly game and not a macho competition, but, of course, Barry doesn't really believe that, with Superman ribbing him about how the fastest man alive could be kicked off the team. They set the stakes. If Flash wins, he gets to tell everyone he won. If Superman wins, Barry must take the team out for brunch, countdown, and race off. Related the fastest superheroes of all time ostensibly, this is the joke, stinger a bit of light humor after the film allowing a bit more character interaction. Indeed, it's of callbacks to various moments in the film proper the entire speed comparison was a running gag between the two, even in forming a major beat in the finale, but the brunch line references Barry admitting to Bruce he hated the meal due to its lackadaisical nature feeling betrayed he shared the personal information and there's a return of his directional confusion, however, it still has quite a bit of weight in the scope of the story, giving a taste of the camaraderie between the no-formed League Superman is truly back as a light beacon of hope and Flash has integrated into the group. In the comics, the duo have a history of competing against each other in foot races and other speed competitions. They first raced in Superman 199, which gave us the iconic shot of the pair racing side by side as the League cheers them on, and the friendly rivalry has been returned to repeatedly over the years. While initially DC had the pair always tying to avoid upsetting fans of either character, over time Flash won a couple of bouts, securing his position as the victor which makes sense, Supes may be fast but was rarely presented as quick enough to turn back time, as for who wins in the DCEU, well, that's not shown and probably for good reason it would be far too embarrassing for whoever loses but if we had to bet, we'd put our money on Barry, assuming he doesn't get lost. This scene would appear to come from the reshoots. Tonally it's more in sync with what Whedon added, right down to the callbacks being to jokes he added, and, of course, Superman has the blurred upper lip caused by the CGI removal of Henry Cavill's moustache. Page 2 of 2, 1-2.